That even stands right at the front of the batter's box. He stands in. Barnett out of the stretch. And the first pitch fastball is in there for a called strike. College baseball here for Jefferis. And the 1 2 is a check swing in the dirt. Darius Perry out in front of home plate. Lobs over to first, and Dalen Reyes covering the bag makes the first out of the ball game. And the Detroit native waiting on the first pitch from Barnett. And he puts it right back up the middle on the ground, but slow. Schreier from short behind the second base bag, feels and throws to first for the outs. Hit in the mid 200s. And so far hitting well this year. Good piece of hitting, and that will drop in in front of John John Vons in right. That pitch elevated and coming in on the hands of Burton. Hit 272 a year ago in 28 games, and he hits a chopper up the middle. Schreier on the move, a race to the bag at second, and he just beats a diving Ted Burton for the final out of the first. Drawn a number of walks as well, and here's number eight on the year. And on the payoff pitch, it's low for ball four. Caro's getting a head start. Here's the pitch. Runner's going, and it's sprayed out to right center, running away from Pace Jr., and he's unable to make the catch. It bounces in front. Darius Perry with an RBI single. Bruins are on the board first. Two and two, they'll pitch. And Yates hits it in the air down the right field line. Rogers on the move into the corner. It's off his glove, a fair ball. One run is in. Perry is going to be held at third. Bruins lead 2 0 on the RBI double from Carson Yates. Both of those runners have now come in. Holman bounces one right back to Denner. He will escort it over to first with an underhand toss. And the side is retired. Two and one. And he rockets this one high and deep to left. Back is Flores looking up. It is gone. Kyle Karos leaves the yard here in the third inning. It's his third jack of the season. Edison always has good programs. And the slider is bounced to short, but it's bungled by Gorson bouncing into right field. That was a slow hopping ball. And Aldrich already used his step off. And this one is high and outside. It's a walk. No runs, a hit. No errors and one left for Michigan. And there's a called third strike on the outside. The back door, two seam fastball there from Aldridge. As Malachi Knight draws a walk. And home plate umpire Angel Campos didn't motion anything. Knight goes again, and this time the pitch is outside, and that is ball four. Last of the fourth. And there's a slider off the second base umpire, and everybody's going to be safe. That could have been two, but it makes contact with Christopher Torres, and the bases will be loaded. Bag looking to turn two. As Reyes puts the first one on the ground, knocked down by Voigt at third. He's able to pick it up and throw out Reyes at first, but a run comes across as Malachi Knight touches up on home. A great effort there from Voigt. That was well struck by Reyes. Here's the pitch. And Karos pulls it to third. Bounces off of Voigt. And he's got no play. Vons will come home to score. That one took a nasty hop coming right up on Voigt's chest. And by the time he picked it up, he thought better than making the throw over to first. Played Pepperdine last week. Again, the runner goes from first. This one pulled on the ground, past the first baseman, into right field. Schreier comes home to score. Karos heads over to third, and the Bruins now lead six to nothing. That one was ripped by Gorson. And now here's Carson Yates, and this one gets away from Sotris to the backstop, and Karos will come home and score. Now seven nothing UCLA on the wild pitch from Voigt. 3-1, and it's low. Another payoff pitch to Holman, and he hits this one to right. Back is Rogers, and he makes the catch on the run, and the side is retired. Here's the 3-2. Swing and a miss. Blew it by him with the fastball. No pitch. Cold strike, three on the outside. Back-to-back -back strikeouts for Finn McElroy. Here's the one, two. Pace is rung up. It's a called third strike on the outside corner. And Finn McElroy strikes out the side in the fifth. 
And now it's Harajli into a second inning of work. And he walks Kyle Karos on five pitches. Three and one. And Gorson takes it up and in. And it's another walk. So wind picks up a little bit. And he misses down and in with the fastball. It's a four-pitch walk. He has walked the bases loaded in the sixth. He is 68 degrees on record. Holman strikes out swinging. Another in the third and four in the fourth. First pitch, and it's a blooper out to shallow center field. It'll get down. One run is in. Gorson comes around to score. He is in. Two RBI bloop single for Malachi Knight, and the Bruins lead 9 to nothing. Two on, two out. First pitch is a blooper on the left side of the infield, and Voigt, the third baseman, will glove it, and that'll end the inning. Here's a good piece of hitting from Longo. This will drop for a base hit in on Carson Yates. Schreier bungles the field there, but it stays right in front of him. This fastball spiking in. It will get to the backstop, and Gasser is in the second. That one bounced by several feet in front of home plate. And three and one, the pitch. And this one hit in the air to right. Vaughn's on the move, leaps, and he makes the catch. Gasser, the runner on third, the pitch. And that one's low again, it's a walk. One, two, half swing, and it's a ground ball to second. Gorson can't make the play, a run scores. Michigan is on the board. Gorson was deep in the hole there on the right side and had to run a long way. And this one hit well, out to left center. Yates on the move, and this one is gone. That ball absolutely crushed by Jake Marty, and Michigan with a four-run inning here in the eighth, a three-run bomb by Marty. In between the fifth and sixth, palm trees out and left. That one was smoked. First of the year for Marty. Playing Voigt to pull on the infield. 2-2, hit in the air towards right center. Vaughn's on the move. He's not going to get there. It'll bounce up off the wall. Voigt into second with a two-out double. And the Michigan Bats have come alive here in the eighth. The home run and a double back to back to back here for Michigan. But there's a swing and a miss to end the inning. High heat coming up and in on Rodgers.